What's up, everybody? You get this tree? I know. It's I know it's not finished. I know. I know. I know. Relax. We'll talk about that in a little bit. Maybe not. But we are going to talk about some disc golf stuff. All right, guys. What's up? So today, since I'm pretty sure Dynamic Disc sent me Winter in uh, in their box of discs that I'm going to do reviews on. Yeah, they, they definitely sent me Winter. Um, when the box got to my house, it was like 70 degrees. I was outside in shorts and t-shirt. Today, it's 44-ish, 40s-ish, raining. Thank you, Dynamic, for sending me Winter. Uh, I'd like to remind you that Florida is a no-winter state. Uh, it is strictly outlawed, and uh, you'll be hearing from my lawyers very soon. <laughs> but uh, so, no, seriously, guys, uh, let's talk. Uh, just a quick little tip that it's a little mindset thing that I wanted to just quickly go over, and it's something that I've been using in disc golf and even in some aspects of just normal day-to-day -day, day -day life. And it's a simple motto. It's a simple thing. It's been out forever. People have said it in the past, but it's something that I just picked up, and that is be better than yesterday. And it works amazing for disc golf. You know, disc golf is a game that you will never perfect. Even the best in the world are not perfect at it. Uh, but if you go out every day or every time you can, and you were better than the last time, better than yesterday, even if it's just one foot further on your drive or you, you, you make one more putt, or you do 10 more putts that day. Anything to just make it better than yesterday in time, you'll prove. And you just, you know, a lot of people get wrapped up in, in I gotta throw 500 feet right now. I gotta do it. Uh, if I don't do it, I'll never be able to compete. I can't do anything. I gotta do it right now. Right, right, right. I gotta make 40 foot putts. If I'm not making all my 40 foot putts, I'm not a good putter. I suck at putting. Relax. Woosa. Be better than yesterday. Start off small, baby steps. It's going to take time. Uh, we're lucky with disc golf as you don't age out of the sport, so to speak, as fast as, say, football or basketball or anything. Uh, we have a guy, he's in the, in the 70s or 60s, 70s, 60s, 80s, somewhere in that range. He had open heart surgery and he was out playing within a month. He went from the Panhandle down to Orlando and played in the tournament. Like, you're not going to age out of it. It's a lifelong thing, man. Relax. I know, I know. You want to be the next Ricky Wasagi. Relax. Take it one day at a time. They've been playing since they were walking. Most of us picked up the sport way later than that. <laughs> so I just need you guys to slow down and just work on being better than yesterday. It'll be, if you can just get that into your head, it's helped me so much and I think it'll help you guys out too. So that's just my little quick tip, cheesy, whatever you want to call it today. I'm just feeling really good. My game's just starting to improve and I'm starting to get back to the way I used to throw and it was just with the mindset of being better than yesterday. Uh, I got a couple reviews coming out later in the week. If you guys haven't follow me on Instagram or Facebook, shame on you. But those of you that are not, give you a little sneak peek, a little fusion witness. As I get it all up in the camera and a uh, loose justice. Those guys, bad boys are coming out. Oh. Those bad boys are coming out very soon. Uh, I think this weekend the weather is going to be warming up so we can knock out those. I should have my boy over too. Get my boy back on the film and get his uh, thoughts on the discs as well. Uh, but yeah, guys, until next time, be better than yesterday. That's all you got to do. Just be better than yesterday. So I'm going to take my my Mr. Rogers butt on over and uh, be better than yesterday. <laughs> All right, guys. Until next time, take it easy.